Konnichiwa. Kepura Kirakto desu. Hello guys, my name is um, yeah, Kepura Kirax and today we will be reacting to some more Niju MVs guys. Um, if you guys haven't seen my first reaction to Niju, I did a Niju MV marathon um, the other day and I'll, if you guys haven't seen it, I'll put it in the direction. But basically I've reacted to their um, pre-debut song, Make You Happy. Their debut song, Step in Step, um, their first single, oh no, their first comeback, um, take a picture and then, I need you, yeah, the first, second single, yeah. Alright, so today we'll be right to the, to the rest of their MVs pretty much, up to their latest um, comeback as well. Well, their latest comeback is actually a new single, so. Yeah. First up, we're gonna react to Chopstick MV. All right. So yeah, let's um, let's just uh, continue from where we left off, pretty much. All right. So this is Niju Chopstick MV. Then there's the titles. Can just change it. <laughs> Oh, I love the Bay Master's voice on this one. Ayaka as well. Keep it Also, you didn't notice they will use the sample at the beginning. It's a classical, um, you know, music sample, pretty much. Chopsticks. Yeah. You know, the title of the MV is also Chopstick. Oh my Yuka. I love Marco's yellow um outfit in this one. Oh <laughs> Ryu. And they Ayaka man oh they give her a lot of lines for this song, I love it. Maybe in Maya as well. And I really like that they're stepping on the piano as well in the MV. <laughs> this This MV is actually like, you know, it's musically it's like a mix of um, pretty much classical music and J-pop. Yeah, it's, it's what it is. And it actually works, you know, it sounds really good. <laughs> and it's one of the reasons why, you know, Niju is just a really unique um, J-pop group as well. <laughs> and we got the Rima playing the piano, yeah? I oh, rap so good, man. Oh. Okay, my, uh, my Yuka as well. Oh. Yeah. Maestro my Yuka, man. Oh. And the Minion Space, man. Oh. And all you see is just keyboards and pianos. He as well playing and play piano um, on space. <laughs> So good, man. If you're gonna compare it, you know, to their previous singles and you know the debut song "Step in Step," this is more like a. It's it's actually a little bit of candy pop, I would say, but it's got that you know, yeah. It's got that you know, um, the classical music sample. Um, combined to the song, which just makes it sound even better, you know. It's just really, it's a really creative um, song for Niju, and I absolutely love it. This is a 10 out of 10. No doubt, 10 out of 10. Alright, let's react to the next um, MV. Asobo. Digital single, Asobo. Also, asobo means, um, you know, play in Japanese. Asobo. It means play, pretty much. Again, the subtitles. <laughs> mm. 
Now this one's a more of a playful, I guess, concept. Cause, you know, the title said the title even means uh, play. <laughs> oh, you got Marco playing a game pretty much. Ah, oh, it's so good. Riku with the blonde hair. Oh. Oh, oh. fun mode. Vogel's just incredible, man. So much really reminds me of. Um, it's got that similar vibe to uh, Dance the Night Away uh, by Twice. Well, I guess it's Niji's version of yeah, Dance the Night Away. It just doesn't have you know the summer concept, and it makes what makes it different, you know, from Dance the Night Away's the, you know, the playful concept. Still different. It's just got that similar vibe, you know. <laughs> Castle magic as well. Let's say this magic word. You must be so good at seeing, man. Oh. This is definitely uh, candy pop um, genre. Candy pop J pop. <laughs> oh, oh. Such a fun song. Such a fun and fun. amazing song. What's it's incredible, it's just amazing. The choreo is also playful, you know. Oh, Nina's got a wand. <laughs> She's insane. <laughs> Alright, so Asobo, yeah, I actually like this one as well. Um, but I like I said, it's not my favorite, you know, Niju song. Or besides, just a really good song, that's all I can say. Probably give this a 9.5 out of 10. Yeah. Alright, now let's move on to the next song, which is. Clap, clap, MV. Alright. Oh, it's right because they're gonna see the vibe to the scene. Let's just watch the MV. Oh, subtitles, yeah. I mean, this is what I love about Niji Man. I mean, they're like twice, but they're also like Tweet Kitsy as well at the same time. And it's, the song has similarities to, I think, Bevel. One of Kitsy's older, older songs. Yeah, definitely, definitely. An Kitsy inspired song. Oh, this is really good, honestly. Clap, clap. Oh, you got real rapping as well. Oh. Ayaka. Riku. Marcos out in there, she looks like Yeji. <laughs> Their outfits are similar to Itzy man, I mean, you can see the influences. Niju on, they're just incredible man. 
and the way it's shot, the end is so really fun to watch. <laughs> A mark on a skateboard, man. That's. I love Nina's outfit in this one. She looks incredible. There we go. The high note, Nina. Nima, oh. This Rio's best song so far. Oh, that part is really catchy. Na 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 na. I'm trying to think of a song um, which is similar to it's see. Um, clap clap. I can't really think of, but it's really got that it's see vibe, man. You know. But overall, yeah, the song's really good. Um, definitely one of my favorites as well. I don't know. From Niju. This one is 10 out of 10. <laughs> Alright, let's move on to the next one. Which is... Uh, that, we're not watching that one. Oh, where did it bloom in the red? Alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's, let's watch the blue moon. This is actually their uh, previous comeback before Paradise. Which came out like just a few weeks ago. Alright, let's, let's watch Blue Moon. Blue Moon. Oh. Oh, this song. Sounds so magical, it sounds incredible. It sounds like an anime um, theme song, man, actually. Yeah, oh, I really love it. As we can see, you know, Ninja has really improved a lot in this one. And I think they're trying to transition to a different side of um, music this time, you know. We've seen them do. Um, Candy Pop before you know with their debut and their previous singles, but now they're they're going for a more I guess magical concept, more a more more J-pop you know influenced song concept as well. Yeah, it's I really like it. Yeah. Oh, because you know. Um, like make you happy and uh, take a picture that's more of a K-pop influence, J-pop song. But this one is pure J-pop, man. And I love it. <laughs> the vocals, oh. oh. I can feel the emotion as well in this song, oh. Me <laughs> here. Mayuka? I guess it's more of an elegant concept as well for Niju. No transition right now for, from you know, Candy Pop to Elegant. It's actually the same as Twice, you know, they went from Candy Pop to Elegant and now to Mature. But for Niju, they went from Candy Pop and now to Elegant concept. And it still really suits them, you know. Oh, Ayaka. She's such a visual man. This song is making me emo. Oh. Kinda of sounds like a fan song as well, though.
This might be my favorite B-side so far from them. I thought Niji was my favorite B-side, but this sounds even better than oh. It's really good with anime um, sound vibes, man. And you know I love anime music as well. so good this is incredible man um yeah blue moon's definitely i would probably have to give it an 11 out of 10 yeah this this is just an incredible um single and by far it's my favorite um single from niju um hands down it's just yeah it's just a really good single man visually musically you can feel the emotions in this one oh it's just so good that's all I can say. Alright, now we're gonna react to their latest um, single. Their fifth single. It's not called uh, Comeback, it's just a fifth single, so. Um, yeah, which is Paradise, which just came out three weeks ago. Alright. It's got a similar vibe to Blue Moon. Another, I guess, full on J pop song. Oh, my Yuka sounds. Yeah, that goes well. Also got that elegant concept. Ooh, Riku with long hair. It's probably just a uh, like wig, but she still looks amazing. They're all wearing wings, man. This one. <laughs> oh, 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 that song. This song already sounds incredible. All oh, the lyrics, I love you so much. I love you as you are in paradise. The treasure is right there. Ah, oh, the again. Oh, it's just more, more, more of a ballad, rock type of uh, J-pop song, I would say. Yeah, because you can hear the guitar in the background. The electric guitar in the background. But yeah, I, lo I love this one as well. Oh, this. Another incredible um, B side. Oh. I don't know, I'm feeling more emo in this one compared to uh, Blue Moon. It's probably because of the lyrics. But it, then again, they're really singing with their emotions on this one as well. Which makes it sound really incredible. Oh, is that Nina? They're literally on the paradise. Oh. Oh, 
酷。啊，你呢？三，三，三，三，三，三，三，三，三，三。So wonderful! It's such an incredible song. That's all I can say. I guess for Paradise, I think this is a. I would give this one a ten out of ten as well. Yeah. Uh, but for me, you know, Blue Moon is still my favorite beside from Need You. But Paradise is also one of my favorites, definitely. Probably my second favorite now, after listening to the MV. This song is just really, just really good. Just, um, definitely, um, musically as well, because you could feel their emotions while they're singing. They're dedicating the song, I guess, to their fans as well, which is the, which is with you, which is their fandom. So yeah, I absolutely love this. You know, fifth single from Niju. Yeah, and I'm gonna end rational guys. Oh yeah! Before we end the reaction, now I'll, I'll give my ranking, I guess, in the songs. Yeah, Blue Moon definitely my favorite, and then followed by Paradise, and then Clap Clap, and then um, A Soul Boy, and then Chopstick would be my least favorite from this um reaction. All right. So that's. Uh, my reaction to Need You, Chopstick MV, um, Asobo MV, Blue Moon MV, and Clap Clap MV, and their latest single, which is Paradise MV. Um, overall, I think Need You is just an incredible J pop girl group, and yeah, they, they've really improved a lot, you know, ever since they debuted. Um, and I just really can't wait for the next comeback. Um, I've heard that they're having plans of. They, I've heard that they're you know. They have plans of um doing. On uh, their first Korean debut as well. Uh, and also their first Korean album. Which they already announced um, a few months ago. And I absolutely can't wait for that. Yep. And all I can say is that need you are just. They're just all talented, incredible, and their music are really worth um, checking as well and listen listening to as well. Yep, um, they've really improved a lot musically and even visually as well. Um, yeah, that's all I can say. So if you guys haven't seen Stan Need You yet, then yeah, definitely Stan Need You. And all the members are just wonderful and likable as well. Yep. All right. So hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to Need You, MV Marathon Part Two. Um, check out my other reactions to Need You as well and other J-pop reactions. I'll put it down in the end of this reaction. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And also follow me on Instagram for the latest K-pop news, especially for Kepler, for Niju. And I do, uh, you know, post J-pop news as well and J-pop uh, girl groups on my stories on Instagram. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys in the next um, Niju reaction. Uh, they're just one of the best, you know groups um in my opinion and currently my favorite J pop group need you.